There's about 17 and a half tons sitting on the back of that semi and about a year's worth of planning and design to get this new boiler worth three quarters of a million dollars built and shipped into town. A lot of that is in the, uh, the control system that's on it, the computers and control valves and uh, all the equipment that actually bolts on the outside. The boiler will be used for Lakeland's power engineering program, which is unique to the area. It deals with the heavy oil because Lloyd Minister sits on top of a very large pool of heavy oil. We're right in the middle of it and uh, there's more heavy oil extraction around here than pretty well anywhere else. So we train our engineers for our specific local uh, market. But the job isn't over yet. A second truck is making its way to the campus and tomorrow a team of about a dozen people will work to bring the 35,000 pound boiler inside here where it will be used by the students. Chris Haveman will be part of that team helping plan exactly what will happen come tomorrow. We have a crane which is going to walk beside the truck and basically pick it up and walk it in through the double door or the single door. Um, then we're going to have to skid it into the building and lift it by hand onto the housekeeping pad. It only fits through the door with an inch to spare. So it's going to take a little bit of work, coordination. It's a job that's expected to take all day. Kelsey Bloxham, New Cap News.